You want answers. I want the truth. You can't handle the truth. Hello, everybody. Breaking, breaking news on a late Thursday night here in the Truth Serum. Joey, the Truth, Wagner with you. What a story this is. Talk about laying the hammer down. Antonio Brown has been traded to the Buffalo Bills. Just reported minutes ago by Ian Rappaport of the National Football League. The Steelers send their star wide receiver to Buffalo. To Buffalo, isn't it great? You get sent to Buffalo. <laughs> get sent to Buffalo. Can you believe it? Buffalo. Antonio Brown, who views himself as a star and a diva, goes to the middle of nowhere. Where Courage the Cowardly Dog lives, Buffalo. But, but anyway, back to, this, to the serious part. <laughs> but back to the serious part. The Steelers, for the last month, have been fielding trade offers. The best deal must have been from the Buffalo Bills. The details of the return have not been reported yet by any source in the NFL. But, everybody, I was thinking of what the return might be. I looked at the draft picks for the Buffalo Bills in this year's draft. They have the ninth pick, the 40th pick, the 75th pick. Those are their top three picks in, in, the, in, the, uh, in the draft. Uh, my guess is that... The 40th pick is definitely involved. That second round pick at number 40 is definitely involved in some way. The first might be involved somehow. The third round pick, number 75, could be involved. Everybody, from what I've heard and from what I've seen, uh, the Oakland Raiders offered a second round pick and a fourth round pick for Antonio Brown. And the Steelers did not take that deal. So I'm guessing that Buffaloes must have been better in some way. So at the minimum, at the minimum in my opinion, I think the Steelers are getting the 40th pick and the 75th pick. A second and third round pick in the draft from Buffalo at minimum. That number 9 pick might be involved somehow, possibly a swapping of picks. I've also seen that as well possibly reported where Buffalo might send picks 9 and 40 to Pittsburgh and the Steelers give them Brown and their 20th pick in, in, in this year's draft, friends. It's all a very fluid situation right now. Uh, I'm looking online right now. I'm still waiting for the... Uh, for any new news to be sent out. But everybody, in case you missed it, breaking news, Antonio Brown going to become a Buffalo Bill. And this year on the on the Steelers docket, one of their home games is against Buffalo. So it won't be long until A.B. makes his return to Pittsburgh. And it'll be very interesting of the reception he'll get from the fans. And it'll be very interesting how he'll be when he comes back to Pittsburgh. I, I mean, I, I mean, folks, this is just another scenario in life. Everybody, I'm going to give you a life lesson. Even at 23 years old, I'm going to give you a life lesson here that I've learned through watching people, listening to people, talking to people. This is, this is what I've learned. The grass isn't greener on the other side. Antonio Brown thought that the grass was greener on the other side. In Pittsburgh, he was a star. He was beloved. He was on track for the Hall of Fame. He had great talent around him. He had the Steelers brand where he would get endorsements. He was getting the ball thrown to him by a Hall of Fame quarterback in Big Ben. 
a dream for a star wide receiver. AB, aka Mr. Big Chest, had the dream here in Pittsburgh. He blew it. He blew it. And now he goes to Buffalo, where he's going to be getting passes from Josh Allen. Josh Allen. He went from Big Ben to Josh Allen. This is going to be unbelievable to watch. Unbelievable. Have fun in Buffalo, Mr. Big Chest. I know you'll love it. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Anyway, folks, as soon as I get the announcement on what the return is in the trade for Pittsburgh, I'll keep you posted. Breaking news here from the Truth Serum, Antonio Brown, now a Buffalo Bill, per ESPN and Ian Rappaport. And before I sign off, I'll just show you how much Antonio Brown loves this trade to Buffalo. Here's what he put on the on the NFL's Instagram page called the deal fake news. Ha ha. Grass is not greener on the other side. Be happy with where you are, folks. Be happy in the present. Be happy in today. Antonio Brown wasn't, and now he's stuck in Buffalo. For the rest of the great crew, from the Truth Serum, Joey the Truth Wagner signing off. Have an awesome night.